2022 Acura MDX Type S. I'm bringing you guys a little walk around in wine country, Napa Valley. It's a beautiful place with a beautiful vehicle here. Driving impressions are embargoed till March 8th. So come back to the channel on March 8th when I can give you driving impressions through these canyon roads. It's quite amazing. But anyways, let's focus on the walk around here. Try to sum it up as quick as possible. There's a lot going on, but let's start with the exterior styling. Now there's two ways to get the MDX. There's a base and an advance. This is the advance. The advance costs about 73K after destination. You can skip some extra features and go for about 68K, but this is the advance. So let's go over what's different on here than maybe the base and what's unique also to the Type S for its styling. We look at the front of the grill here we have about 15% greater airflow through this porous grill. Of course, we have the Type S badge. We have paint matched uh, grill surround, which looks great on the Diamond Pentagon grill, but also this paint color is amazing. Tiger Eye Pearl, I was very lucky to be one of the journalists to snap this up as quickly as possible. We also have sub radiators behind these functional vents on the side, gives uh, additional airflow and cooling to the engine with the three liter. We'll get into that. I'll, I'll pop the hood in a little bit, but let's get, get into the wheels. These are only on the advanced package, uh, this two-tone finish. And behind the 21 inch wheels, we have four piston Brembo brakes. Tires are Continental Cross Contact with 275 by 40 with the 21 inch wheels. Type S badge there on the sides. We walk back, we got some unique things about this advance. A part of that is the glossy bottom of the vehicle as well as the wheel surrounds are unique to the advanced package. Also we have what's unique to the MDX is the black door finish. It's chrome on the standard MDX. We also have black mirrors and a little uh, blackout trim piece here. I guess it looks pretty cool. Type S always looking great with a badge. Of course the window surrounds are all blacked out here on the Type S. We come around the side Man, this Tiger Eye Pearl just looks so good in the sunlight, so much sparkle to it. Uh, I know the rear is kind of in the shadows here, but we do have standard chrome here on the back of the tailgate, which is, I guess, somewhat matching. Silver finish of the quad tip exhaust to give you guys an idea. Um, here's my hand and yeah, they're, they're huge. The quad tip exhaust is massive. We also have this diffuser back here, glossy black that is unique to the MDX Type S. Of course, we have parking sensors, another black trim piece on top of the bumper. Our last Type S badge here. All right, get into the cargo space. It looks very similar to the normal MDX, nothing crazy here. Power outlet here, press and walk away hatch close. If I fold this up, some additional storage. Acura is very good at hiding storage. It's kind of from their Honda heritage. Uh, here's the window sticker, so if you guys wanna see it, and this is predestination, so add about $1,000 on top of that. Underneath the hood is signature to Type S. This is the three liter turbocharged. It's a single turbo, dual scroll, max torque, 354 pound-feet of torque at a low 1400 RPM. You also have 355 horsepower at 5,000 RPM or so. Love this engine in the TLX Type S. It's made it to the same a Sport Tune 10-speed automatic transmission but I can't talk too much about the engine and how it behaves. That's embargoed, but I think it's time for us to hop inside the interior because this is a very luxurious experience. Excuse my bag that I have there. We have beautiful Milano stitched seats and the advanced package gives you additional adjustments. It's, I believe it's 16 weight. And then you also have massaging seats and check this out. As I get in, there's a dedicated button right here to massaging seats so you can control the uh, intensity you can also press and hold and it's going to give you different massaging seat options there so as i was driving through the canyons it's awesome to have a little shiatsu on my back steering wheel excellent quality here a unique type s badge here at the bottom kind of like the a spec steering wheel it's a good steering wheel it doesn't feel uh any more special than it did in the a spec though What's also unique to this MDX Type S Advance is you get the huge heads up display. The font is really, really big on it. You'll get this large screen no matter what trim you get. What's also unique is the ELS 3D Studio Signature Edition. This sound system has carbon fiber cones. It also has speakers underneath the center console here. You have speakers 
and underneath it, the handles, I mean, they're just everywhere. And the sound comes out you, you feel like you're ba bathing in sound with this ELS. Here's our drive mode knob, which of course, since it's a type S, we have sport. If I hold it, it'll go into sport plus, but it also has a new mode called lift. So this has air ride suspension and lift will give you a couple more inches of ride clearance. And as I felt the vehicle, it's very smoothly going back and forth, leveling itself out. So yeah, pretty cool that we have air ride in here. We'll help it ride a little bit smoother. In theory, definitely stay tuned for the driving impressions. We also have Type S skid plates that need to get in the back row. We also have Type S here in the second row of seats as I get in the vehicle, close the door. Very solid sound here. Use the sunshade, why not? Just like the regular MDX, we have this huge center seat here that can also be removed. So you can make this a four seater with captain's chairs if you want, but it's nice to have like this, you know, big armrest here instead. Down here at the bottom, a couple USBs, uh, a 112 plug-in, so you can charge your laptop, work in here as a mobile station a little bit if you need to, for especially for your passengers. Uh, another 12 volt accessory here, like we saw in the back. Heated outboard seats, which is also unique to the Advanced. We also have a beautiful panoram panoramic sunroof, which I did not mention. So yes, I appreciate a little bit more in the back seat than I can in the front seat, of course. Again, a smattering of ELS speakers back here. But definitely come back March 8th for full driving impressions of the MDX Type S, the first ever Type S crossover from Acura. It's good to have more Type S in our lives, guys. Definitely stay tuned for the driving impressions. I'll catch you in the next video.